Welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I'm going to show you how to restore these headlights on this 2008 Hyundai Sonata. So first, a couple things you're going to need is sandpaper. I have 3000 grit, 1000 grit, well you're going to start off with 1000 grit, a microfiber cutting pad. You can use a regular foam cutting pad, but because I'm going to be using a 3000 grit and not like a 5000 grit, this is going to cut through the sanding marks quicker and faster. We're going to be using Meguiar's 85 um, 2.0 diamond cut and then we're going to use Meguiar's uh, M205 to finish it off. You can use, and then for the final step it's up to you. You can use a wax, a paint sealant. I'm going to be using a coating to top it all off because you're going to be removing the clear coat off the headlight. So the headlight's been wiped down with uh, isopropyl alcohol and it's also been cleaned obviously. So now we're going to spray some water to give the sandpaper lubrication. Also, obviously, tape off the headlight. And let's get started. I have this setting to the drill on 24, which is the highest setting. And I'm going to apply medium pressure to it. And this is the 1000 grit sandpaper that I'm using. Now what you're going to do is wipe off the headlight to see what you need to keep sanding. Because remember, whatever you have left under the sanding marks is what's going to be polished back. So you want to remove all the imperfections with the sandpapers first to make it easier. Because your compounds and polishes aren't going to remove all that. So this looks pretty good. So I'm going to step up because there's no more big defects so now I'm going to use 3000 grit sandpaper which is this one right here again I'm, these are just Meguiar sandpapering sandpaper pads you can use 3M you can use whatever you want it's pretty much all the same but I built this kit so this isn't one you this isn't like 3M or anything so this is just a hodgepodge of parts here and make sure your pads are on properly like that, they're centered up and all that. Let's get started. And again, it's on the highest setting with medium pressure. And again, just wipe off. And then it's all clear, and then you have a uniform mark. I'll show you right here. See how it's very uniform as you come across. No more yellow haze or anything. This is what you're looking for. Almost perfect. So, now we're going to begin our compounding. A microfiber, microfiber cutting pad with Meguiar's M85 and again I have it on the high speed setting and I'm going to work it across the headlight just a wee bit work it in there and again this compound has a diminishing abrasive into it so you want to work it all the way in to the headlight that way you get the best finish which will make polishing with the M205 easier
So now, I forgot to mention this earlier, and I'll put this at the beginning of the video. Um, you're going to need a foam pad for the polishing because you can't polish with the microfiber cutting pad. Well, not as well. So anyways, take your compound, and I'm going to work it into the pad. And we're going to start going. And again, I have it on its highest setting. You can, what you can do is you can jewel it back. Um, it's called jeweling, where you work the polish, because polishes, because again, it's a diminishing comp, they're diminishing abrasives. If you slow it down a little, Now take a clean side of the microfiber towel and wipe off the polish and you'll have whatever finished product you're going to end up with. If you're not satisfied, again, you can just repeat the steps. If you missed something at the beginning of the sanding, and like I'll show you here, here's the polished, all completely done. Here's the side that ha hasn't been done. and. You can see the difference. It looks pretty freaking amazing. If you come across to the other headlight, that's your final completed product when you're done. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content and have a great day. Thanks, bye. All right, so the headlight's all cleaned up. I finished it off. I had to go back and do a little bit of uh, extra work to it. But as you can tell, look how clear that headlight turned out. Turned out pretty freaking good. So like I said, don't be afraid to redo a couple of steps. I had to. Obviously because I was just polishing off half the headlight for you guys. I, I was only completing half the headlight um, when I was doing the compound and polishing. But just wanted to give you a final look at it. And there it is. So if you like all that, don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments section. And again, if you want your headlight to look like that, follow those steps. And if you have to, remember you can you can just repeat any of those steps, especially if you forget about the sanding part. If you don't sand out all the imperfections at the beginning, you're gonna have to go back and repeat those. I know it gets annoying, but if you want perfection, that's what kind of what you're gonna have to go for. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Thanks. Bye.